And look at them. Look at them heads, y'all. Man, this is dang fire, y'all. Yeah, man. Keep your dogs working. Because a bored dog is a bad dog. Remember that. I might start at the beginning. Keep your dog. I'm, I'm going to put this at the beginning. Keep your dogs working because a bored dog is a bad dog. Remember that. A bored dog is a bad dog. Be more. Yo, 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 before this video start, man, first of all, shout out to all my supporters. Make sure y'all continue liking, continue commenting. A couple y'all ain't commenting in a while. I know who you are now. I'm going to call you out now. Make sure you comment, man. Um, I also want to remind you guys, you know, when you're looking for a breeder, man, make sure you, you step to a, a reputable breeder, man, somebody that clearly shows, you know, shows you that they, they care, you know, they give a damn, lack of a better term, shows you that they give a damn. I see a lot of breeders uh, online, man, it's, so ratchet, bad representation of you know what breeders could be. You got you have the ratchet ones, and uh, they ain't even a certain race. You know they just they just too ratchet. You know you have to be laid back. Um, when I say ratchet, I mean you just applying pressure to other breeders and just just dissing other breeders and calling them stupid and stuff. And truth enough, I don't I don't think you know everything. You know you you think you do, but I don't think you know everything. So watch out for them type of people, man. Just want that make a living off of just bashing other breeders because. I mean, who are you? You know. But anyway, make sure y'all like, share, subscribe. Now let's watch the video. Remember, it's 80 degrees in South Carolina, so I had to make this video really quick because um, I don't know where you guys stay, but when it's when it's 80 degrees in South Carolina, it feels like it's 100. So I never want to, you know what I'm saying, work the dogs for a long period of time. Work them a little bit, then give them a break. And go ahead, wait a couple hours or something, work them a little bit more, then give them a break. You know what I'm saying? If I'm going to do a long stint, I wait till it's uh, cooler. As you can see, this is this is post video, <laughs> and I was a, oh shout out to my family back there. Y'all see them? Shout out to my fam, man. I love them to death. They the reason why I do this. You guys the reason why I do this. Shout out to all the love I've been receiving. Let's start the video. GP gang, as y'all can see, you got Drake, <laughs> and uh, people be asking, man, how how your dogs got all your dogs just got drive like that, man? You can actually build drive. People be thinking. They dogs, oh, look, look at Ivory. Yeah. yeah. People be thinking they dogs don't have drive, but what really happening, what really happens is your dog don't know that it's okay. That drive is okay. Ah, sit. 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 Ivory, sit. Thank you. Dutch, sit. Drake, sit. Thank you. See, what really happens is your dog don't know they're supposed to have drive. You know, look at them. So they got to know it's okay. So first you start off with sit, sit. All right, but sit. First they got to know it's okay. So that's why you start off, you know, having them so low, you know, let them, let them bite the pillow a little bit. Let them bite the ball. It depends on what kind of drug. See, you see her? I don't know if y'all remember my first video. She wasn't really going after the ball, but you see, she was over there playing with the ball by herself. But yeah, you have them bite it. You know, you, you make them fall in love with it before you start any training. You see how they just went to that ball? You make them fall in love with it before you start any training. All of them. You make sure all of them. Don't, don't, you know, don't, don't bat, you know, bat them, no, you stop, you know, none of that. Let them, let them fall in love with it. And then, this is my new trick, y'all. You got, look, this is copyrighted by GSP Riders, man. You get, you get you a bike pillow, get you a leash, wrap it around it. Just like you, look at Drake. Drake, sit. But yeah, wrap it around it like that, like you would do with like a, a slip knot, whatever that you put on a leash. That way it tightens at you, whatever. You don't want to. But yeah, slip knot it like this. Sorry, y'all, that man knocked my dang freaking thing over. That's how they drive is. But yeah, have it like that. And they ready. Stay. Stay. Ah, stay. Look at them. Stay. See? Killer drive. Killer drive, no matter. Ah, stay. Look at her. She can't help it. She can't help it. He can't either. They can't help it. They're addicted. I got him addicted. Stay. Stay. Anyway, that's a scream, y'all. And show. But you see, you see, it don't really matter. 
It don't really matter. You know what I'm saying? The GMB rider gonna go crazy regardless. They gonna go crazy regardless. Check them out. We ain't gonna let them do this too long, y'all, cause I ain't gonna break my damn bike pillow. But yeah, just wanna show y'all, man. You get them on some one-on-one -on -one drills like this, y'all? Man, I'm tell you, they love this. Love this. Look at them. And they, they, they exhausting a lot of energy out here, right, y'all? Look at them, they pretty. Ain't they? God damn, I got some pretty dogs, y'all. Look at them. All four of them just look great. Look at them. Look, size, color, man. What, is, what else you want, bro? Your head? What else you want, man? Get y'all a GFP dog, man. I know I ain't got no puppies on the ground, but when they come, <laughs> y'all better make sure y'all just snatch them up. Look, what's hell in this y'all, boy? Telling you. Telling you. And y'all know I put that work in. But yeah, man, that's how you build that drive, man. Look at them. Look at the three that been here for a while. And look, she didn't she didn't even fool with balls, but now look at them. You feel me? Just gotta do, man. You gotta work with them, man. Once you work with them, man, I'm telling you. Now these dogs, you know, they gonna pass it down today. You gotta think about it. You get a dog from me. You, the mama's already got dry. The mama's gonna be showing puppies how to do it. I'm gonna be showing your puppies how to do it. So by the time your puppies eight weeks, man, sound is not gonna be a problem. You know what I'm saying? Basic training is not gonna be a problem. And that drive is not gonna be a problem. And I know some people, some of you guys, oh, I don't want them to it. I don't want them to be, have a high prey drive. Y'all, this drive I'm talking about right now, this is not prey drive. This is just pr driving, period. You know, this is drive, you know, so you can be able to teach them something. Because how can you teach a dog anything if you, if you don't know what they like? They don't want nothing. They don't want nothing from you. Attention. This bite pillow here. A ball. They don't want anything. How you going to teach them something? And I guarantee you, you guys, you do not want to be the owner of a dog that doesn't want anything from you. Doesn't want anything from you. Because how can you teach them anything and have them any discipline? You know? And that's how people end up with dogs in the shelter and stuff. Because... They think a dog is just supposed to, oh, yeah, it's going to be all right, period. No. You get out here, you find out what that dog loves. You use what they love to teach them how to do things that you want them to do. That way you both have a great relationship and you can talk to each other. It's all about communication. Think about it. You teach your kids, you know, English, right? Or, you know, if you're Hispanic, you teach them Spanish, right? Why? To have a better communication. Same thing with dogs, y'all. I'm going to keep this video short, though. Yeah, I know we got her on a, on, on, on a big workout plan, so we want her to work out a lot. But yeah, we're going to keep this video short though, man. It's hot, and I don't want to work them out too hard. But I just wanted to show y'all, you know, what you can do. This is South Carolina too, y'all. Probably a little hotter here than it is. Look at that girl. That girl beautiful, man. That girl beautiful. That girl beautiful. That, girl, <laughs> that boy beautiful. Hey, it's, it's heat over here, y'all. Drake. I mean, not Drake. Drake over there. Drake over. Let's see. That's it. Sit. Sit. Good girl. Stay. Stay. You see that? Got it working, but why the, the dry still there? Get some. 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 It don't matter. It don't matter. We're going to keep it short for y'all, man, because we don't want to work them there, but we're going to show y'all. We're going to show y'all, man. Once you got them at, at a certain area, man. I'm telling you, man. Look. I'm telling you, man. Look. That's all four of them, y'all. Telling you. What, what more can you ask for? What more can you ask for, man? This is what you want, man. This is what you want. I appreciate y'all, man. Make sure y'all like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff, man. And look at them. Look at them heads, y'all. Man, this is dang fire, y'all. Yeah, man. Keep your dogs working. Because a bored dog is a bad dog. Remember that. I might start at the beginning. Keep your dog. I'm, I'm going to put this at the beginning. Keep your dogs working because a bored dog is a bad dog. Remember that. A bored dog is a bad dog. Peace out.